What's up everybody, Dazed here, back with another Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 video, and today we are talking about the new V-Jump scans, and as you can tell by the title already, we have none for DLC 13 for Xenoverse 2. Now, we gotta talk about what this means for the DLC, because a lot of people were very disappointed with that last trailer they showed us, and they told us the fourth would be the last of the Canton City TV trailers coming out. So, we're going to talk about that right now, and is this good or bad? Well, it's, it's bad in the fact that we are not getting any new information, which means, you know, not another character, there's going to be no extra stuff from everything we've seen so far in the game, but it's also good in a way, because that means that the release date should be coming soon. Usually, when they stop posting in the V-Jump magazine, stop showing new stuff, that means that DLC is coming soon after that, so this is very good news for everybody that has just been waiting so long for this DLC. Now all these scans are coming by way of DBS Hype over on Twitter, so go give them a follow. But uh, I didn't post them all because there was no point. I just grabbed a few of them. There was no point because there is nothing for Xenoverse 2. And uh, like I said, that is a very good thing. Uh, going by previous DLCs, whenever the, the V-Jump scans stop, the DLC is released soon after. So this is very good news. And there is still hope uh, for everybody out there that was like hoping this was going to come out for the five year anniversary. There is still hope for that to happen because, you know, any other time they've announced the release date, like even back with the last one, it only came out about 10 days later. So there is still hope that we're going to get this right around, not the exact date, but right around the the five-year anniversary which also begs the question will we get that five-year anniversary event because last year you know the, it was like the first week in November we actually got a four-year anniversary event which was pretty good you know not the greatest thing in the world but it was pretty good I'm gonna go over that too and what we can expect to see in a five-year event in a future video but yeah this is not all bad news guys just because we didn't get no new scans that does not mean it's bad that actually is a good thing we should be getting this sooner rather than later. And, uh, you know, the only big thing is, is we're not getting another character. So we're, we're not getting that hero vote character. And we're not going to get any more information as of right now, as of, you know, with the V-Jump magazines. No more information on Super Saiyan God. So we're probably just going to have to wait until that free update comes out to see what it's all about. But yeah, stay tuned for another another video because I will be going over everything that we know so far for DLC 13 in detail. Well guys, that is going to wrap this video up. If you do like the content I'm putting out, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.